Hello everyone. I'm so excited to launch the new Azure Data Engineering Masters program. After the super successful Big Data Masters program, this is the second course in the list. Right? So for those who do not know about me, I am Sumit and I am leading Big Data Mentor in the industry. You can check my LinkedIn. I have more than 130k followers on LinkedIn. People follow me for the content I post. I have completed my master's from NIT Trichy and have worked for some top companies like Cisco and VMware primarily on big data projects. I have consistent five-star Google rating primarily because of my teaching style. And I have trained more than 10,000 people all across the globe, across 18 plus countries. And some of my students are leading big data team in topmost companies like Google, Amazon, Walmart. So with this, let's get started. So the message for you all, I have put in my best to develop this course and you will see that when you start going through the content, you will realize that the efforts that have been put in, right? So basically the major focus areas of this course will be Azure data lake storage, data bricks, data factory snaps. Although we will be covering a lot of other things, but those will be for the sake of completeness. These four things, Azure Data Lake Storage, Data Breaks, Data Factory, and Synapse will be the major topics that we'll be covering in absolute depth, right? So as you know, big data is everything today. And this is the right time to make an entry as a Azure Data Engineer because Azure Data Engineers are in super high demand these days. What are the prerequisites to join this program? I would say if you have knowledge on computer science fundamentals and some basic understanding of SQL, that should be good enough. However, I have people who were from non IT and could grab because they got some basic understanding of SQL and some computer science fundamentals from outside. So ideally anyone can learn, but the best fit crowd are the ones who are from IT domain. Okay, now what all will be covered as part of the program? We will start with Azure Cloud Fundamentals. For those who do not know about cloud, you will get to know. We will be talking about Azure Data Lake Storage, ADLS Gen 2 primarily. We will be talking about Azure Data Factory, which is very, very important. And the most important thing in the course is Azure Databricks. We will be touching on Spark Fundamentals, but let me tell you, this is not a Spark course. If you really want in-depth insights on Spark, then you should opt for my Big Data Master's program. So this is not a course to learn Spark, even though 10 to 12 hours of Spark content will be here, but that won't be, I would say, making you master of Spark that way. We'll be covering Azure Synapse Analytics, and we have some additional modules like HD Insight, Key Vault, Cosmos DB, Event Hub, and can be few more topics based on your request. Now, the additional modules are not the primary focus areas. These are for the sake of completeness. For example, if we are learning 10 topics, does not mean I spent equal time on each topic. I know the industry trend. I know there are four topics which would require much more effort than other topics. So I have focused on those as per their industry demands. I'm open to take any feedback from you. If you say that, sir, this is the thing which can probably help all of the people as it's in demand industry. I'll be open to take that and add as part of the program if I feel that can help others. But this is what I'll be covering. Now, how exactly the course flows? It is more than 65 plus hours of on-demand content. What do I mean by on-demand? So basically every week I'll be releasing around two and a half hours of videos. It will be spanned across, across five to six videos. Let's say each, each video might be 20 minutes, 25 minutes, 30 minutes, right? Now it would take roughly five to six hours for you to complete that, right? Most of you would be working professionals. So I want to tell you that you have to spare five to six hours 
of your time every week in order to get the best out of this course. Let's assume six hours. I'll be conducting some mentorship sessions. The session will be taken by me or by industry experts. P roughly there will be one session every month, which will give you insights on what is happening around. Also, every week there will be the quizzes and the certificate will be given based on your weekly results. So you might ask me, sir, what is the duration of this program? 65 plus hours is okay, but what's the duration? Roughly, it will take six months for you to be a master of Azure Data Engineering. Six months, right? Every week, two and a half hours content is released, which will take five to six hours for you. Mentorship sessions are there. Quizzes are there every week. You will get certificates every week. And upon course completion, you can even opt for mock interviews. Now, what if you have some doubt or you get stuck with any of the practicals? For that, we have an extensive Slack support channel, right? So you can post your queries over Slack and our team will be helping you to resolve that. Ideally, our team replies in a few hours, but we say 24 hours is our response time on a safer side. Now, as part of this entire course, I'll be covering two end-to-end -end real time projects, which will give you the insights on how industry works on real time projects. So this will give you a lot of confidence around how to work in a company. Upon the completion of the course, you will get a final course completion certificate. You can showcase it on any of the social media platforms like LinkedIn. A lot of recruiters are looking at it, right? So this will really help. Also, when you are about to give interviews, we will help you prepare your resume and we will give you enough guidance on how to do that. I'll also conduct a session on how to build your LinkedIn profile and how to create your personal brand so that you start getting a lot of calls and people see you as an expert in big data, right? Also, we have a placement cell and we'll guide you with the placements. So that's about it. And see the course reviews for the people who have taken the course with me in the previous batches. That's what they have to say. You can just see that the kind of results which my course is getting or the way I have explained the things, people are really enjoying that. You can see from these comments, right? Now talking about the fee structure and registration process. So just to let you know, we have right now a pre-launch offer going on. So let me first tell you what is the course fee. If you are taking the course from India, that means if you want to access the course from India, course fee is 38,500 plus 18% GST, right? Which is this amount. But if you are enrolling before 24th November 2022, before 8 p.m. India time, you get a flat 10,000 rupees discount and the fee will be 28,500 plus 18% GST, which is 33,630. Now talking about if you are taking the course from outside India, right? And if you are looking to access the content from anywhere outside India, the course fee, actual course fee is 550 USD. And we are right now running a $125 flat discount as part of the pre-launch offer, which is valid till 24th November. And the effective course fee will be 5, 425 USD, right? You can see the payment links. The If you are from India and accessing the course from here, you need to click on this rupee button. Otherwise you click on the dollar button, right? Make sure if you are accessing the course from outside India, you do not pay in Indian rupees. You will not get the proper results because there will be streaming issues and all because it's server based access, right? So make sure you do it accordingly. And in case if you are, let's say in some other country and cannot pay in USD, you request to us and we can generate a payment link in that currency. However, otherwise you can pay in USD itself. Now, beyond 24th November, 8 p.m., we cannot extend this offer. And this is a pre-launch offer, which is quite a huge offer that we are running right now, right? If you're paying in INR, if you're from India, you also can offer a three months, no cost EMI 
on all major credit cards. You can see that option. Otherwise, you can pay through UPI also. But the three months no cost EMI is on all major credit cards, which you will see as offers there. So that's about it. And with this, we have come to the end. If you want to follow me on LinkedIn, Twitter, Instagram, you do click on these icons and you can basically go to my profile and see that. Now the new batch is starting on 26th November. That is a Saturday. Once you make the payment, let's say, you will get an automatic confirmation on your email regarding the payment that you have made. You will get a receipt for that. And within 24 hours, we'll be rolling out a form where we'll be collecting your details so that we can create your account, right? For your account creation, we'll be collecting your details. That form you will get within 24 hours. And once you fill that, we will be creating your account and we'll be giving you a Zoom link for the welcome session. What is a welcome session? So basically on 6 p.m. Saturday, that is 26th November, Mansa from our team will be conducting a live session where she'll be telling how to access the content, how to start with the course, right? She will be helping you to get started with it. So that's the welcome session, which will happen on coming Saturday at 6 p.m. So with this kind of, we have come to the ending of it, but I want to say one thing, this is the best time that you can make an entry as a Azure data engineer. Azure data engineers, are in super high demand and the kind of results that you can get after doing this course you cannot even believe that right and the results have been as good as my big data masters program you can check my google reviews you can check what people are talking about it and i have put in enough efforts i have put in my best in order to deliver the results and that's what shows from the results of the candidates which is coming so with this Let's end it up and definitely I'm uh, hoping that this gives you the best thing and this can be one of the best investment that you can ever make in your career. So with this, let me end it up. All the best.